everyone, we're here at Billy Bob's on the red carpet and not because I'm winning an award, no, actually for something a little bit better for the Texas Country Music Awards where any second now we'll be surrounded by Texas's brightest country music stars. We got dressed and ready for the occasion, so let's go ahead and make our way and meet some of the nominees. Hosted in a different hockey talk every year, presented by the Texas Country Music Association, the TCMA's is Texas Country's biggest event, bringing talented artists from all over the state together under one roof. First time out here at Billy Boss for the Texas Country Music Awards, but Alex Gova, you are no stranger to this event. So, no. welcome back, and what are you out here for? Nominated for uh, Emerging Artist of the Year. Female Vocalist of the Year and yeah. Song of the Year. Emerging New Emerging Artist. artist. Yes, How does that feel, man? It feels pretty cool. It's setting in a little bit more now yeah. that we're here at Billy Bob's. So not only are you up for one, two, but three awards tonight. What is going through your mind? How are you feeling? Give us all the, the feels. I'm getting a little nervous. I mean, it's <laughs> it's definitely um, an honor to be up with all these people and uh, just to be in such great company and Texas country music company. Yeah. Like, I love it. I love everything about being in Texas and getting to do music here. Oh, I love it. Okay, so the song that puts you on the map, what, what inspired that? Uh, well, it was, like I said, the song was called The Oilfield Dad and uh, you know, that's what the song is about, leaving my family at home and going out and trying to make a living, you know. And that's what put me on the map, and then ever since then, I've just let my heart be my guide, you know. So how would you describe to someone who's just turned, coming into that Texas country music scene, your style and your sound, how would you describe it? I would say it's a mix between Americana and folk. Oh. Uh, keep it kind of simple, let the guys with the bands record them if they want to and add their flavor and their steel and fiddles. Me personally, my style and sound is more of like kind of classic country. I kind of throw in a lot of classic country too yeah. as well as Texas country. Like I said, I pride myself on singing old fashioned country music, yeah. traditional country music, 70s to 90s, and I write my own country music. We listened to your music, we were kind of describing it in the car ride over here. We think that you're kind of like a Martina McBride slash Carrie Underwood feel. How would you say and describe your style of music and sound? God bless you. They're like my favorite women in the world. Yeah, like seriously. Nailed it. <laughs> they're just powerhouses and they're so strong in their messages and what they have to say to people and their fans and that's definitely my style of music and, and I, I just want to inspire people and make people smile with mine. Who is your inspiration as far as your, your sound of music and how you play? My biggest influence writing songs would be Monty Merle Haggard. Yeah. Show him that tattoo, huh? I got Merle on my arm. <laughs> I got Will oh, Nelson nice. right there. I got to put you on the spot. You are a songwriter. We haven't quite got down a, an intro song. Okay. Can you put together maybe a little ditty for oh, yeah. Yellow Texas Travel Show? Oh, I, I know I can. <laughs> <laughs> Coming up, we head inside the venue for live performances only on YOLO Texas. Hi, my name is Brandon Ryder, and you're watching YOLO Texas. Hey y'all, welcome back to Yellow Texas where we are inside of Billy Bob's in Fort Worth, Texas for the Texas Country Music Awards. Presented by the Texas Country Music Association, we met with the organization's leading couple, Linda and Richard Wilson. We just do our best to try to get the artists out there that really don't get hurt. I mean, we love the big guys, but you know, yeah. the big guys don't need us, but the, but the other guys do. So so that's kind of, kind of where it came from. And then we decided to try our hand at doing an award show having started it in 2014 and 15. And, uh, and we, that went over so well that we decided to look for a larger market to go into. So we, we came to Fort Worth, we looked around and we settled on Fort Worth. It's Cowtown, it fits, it's perfect. Yeah. And that's what we try to do. Oh, absolutely. And you are doing a wonderful job at doing that. Last question, because fans get to sit in and enjoy being a part of this Texas country music scene. So what can they do all weekend long, specifically the day of the awards ceremony? Well, today at four o'clock we have, and I'm really proud of this, we have the Musician and Songwriter Awards. We've got some showcase artists that are playing during the pre-show, yeah. and then we we're gonna take a little bit of a break, and then our main award show will kick off at six. And if you're a fan of the genre, getting a chance to speak with Brandon Ryder himself 
is definitely a treat. I'm sorry for being a little starstruck because I listen to your music all the time and it's great to be here next to you, the host of the Texas Country Music Awards today. What's in store? What should we expect as ah. far as everything tonight? Well, I mean, to be able to have this event in its third year, it's kind of the granddaddy of, of yeah. it all of for me. Tons. I think yeah. it's a, a really great set and everybody's looking forward to it. Um, I think it looks like it's going really smooth right now. It looks so, really good. Can't wait for that opening monologue. You got yeah. something kind of cool, fun, Well, quirky? I'm just going to step in there and not, not try to, you know, mess it up. <laughs> the TCMAs has 21 categories with five finalists acknowledging the very best industry pros and artists. My co-host and uh, winner already, Ms. Jen Ford. This is our third year in a row that we've been able to partake in this event. We're so excited to be here at Billy Bob's Texas. <laughs> With that said, let's present the Christian Country Single of the Year. 2019 Texas Country Music Awards Country Album of the Year goes to... Female Artist of the Year is... Josh Ward! <laughs> Holly Tucker! I ain't got much to say. I love Texas and I'm proud to be a Texas artist. Could do that. Sprinkle in live performances from the nominees. You got yourself quite the show. All right, y'all, that is the end of the award show, and we hope that we were able to just shed some light and share the stories on some of these amazing and talented up and coming rising stars. You know, Texans, we always do a really good job at supporting each other and sticking together. So make sure to start planning for next year's event and see all of this for yourself. If you want to attend the ceremony for yourself, head on over to texascountrymusic.org for show information.